All right, celebrity presence is well there at uh, Rajpat. The Prime Minister Nayan Modi is expected to reach in a short while from now, where he'll be inaugurating uh, the Swachh Bharat Abhiyan, the Clean India campaign of uh, the NDA government on the occasion of Gandhi Jayanti. With us in our studios, we have uh, Mr. Dilip Cherin, image consultant. We also have with us Mr. Gopal Krishna, environmental activist and convener, Toxics Watch, uh, who's joining us live from the Patna studio this morning. On a live link with us, we also have uh, our deputy editor, Atir Khan, who is at Rajpath uh, tracking developments on the ground. I'm going to come to you first, Atir Khan. Take us through uh, what you are seeing around you, celebrity presence as well. We got a reaction from Amir Khan. Are you seeing a lot of uh, people who've gathered there to welcome the Prime Minister and watch him uh, launch his campaign? So that's right, you see the stage is all set behind me, as you can see, that is the place where the Prime Minister is going to address this, uh, uh, you know, he's going to administer the pledge and uh, elaborate arrangements have been made, uh, both security and otherwise, you see, uh, there are celebrities who have joined here, we have Amir Khan, the film star, we have Vijendar Singh and others, eminent sports personality, we had spoken to Sadanand Koda, the Railways Minister, Delhi LG is also present here and uh, school children in large number have gathered here and it's not just about uh, 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 cleanliness it's about the mindset uh, you know the uh, the Prime Minister is talking about it's his favorite project and remember when he took over the office it was the first thing he started he had sent uh, you know communication to all government offices to ensure that they are neat and clean so it is very important and he's also associated cleanliness with uh, FDI first developed India uh, that is the per per uh, precursor to development and he, uh, there has to be, it has to, the place says that uh, this mindset has to come from oneself, from one's residence, one's lane, one's village and uh, your offices. So it is clearly a Herculean task but then the Prime Minister has support of the entire Council of Ministers and there is uh, today also we see a large number of supporters who have come here and it, uh, hopefully this will become a force multiplier and this campaign is going to be a big success. All right, uh, Ati, the Prime Minister of course saying that he wants this to turn into a mass campaign. He wants people uh, to pick up uh, broomsticks and start cleaning their surroundings and ensure a litter-free India by 2019. Mr. Sharon, if I come to you first, you're an image consultant, you're an image guru. How do you see, uh, how do you read these pictures of Prime Minister Modi wielding a broomstick, participating in a Safai Abhyan? He says he's very serious about this campaign, but do you think it's a mere photo opportunity? Can, can, it, or can it also translate into a game changer for the NDA government? The first image it conveys is that of, an, of a Prime Minister with obviously amazing energy because here is a man who is fasting for, for nine days in America, he has been there for five days and he has landed in and caught a broom in the morning. So this is a man with amazing energy. The second image it conveys is a man who is a Prime Minister but believes in taking the micro before he st starts tackling the macro. You know. Uh, Cleaning up India is actually a micro task. It needs to be handled literally at the ground level. And only after that can you start changing people's behavior. So the first thing is to clean it up. And I think uh, the, the symbolism of a, uh, of a prime minister wielding a broom is a strong symbol. And I hope it actually inspires not just his cabinet colleagues and the token children who may, uh, may be involved in it today, but actually involves local panchayats and others where there are vast armies of cleaners who are virtually sitting on their haunches. So the fact is that we have a cleaning arrangement which is into the system and paid for, but it's vastly underutilized. And then the public needs to be involved in it to make sure they don't add to it. Absolutely, the government wants to, uh, trans uh, wants to convert this into a mass uh, campaign.